Today's how to build is on Pikachu. Don't forget to check out all my other video game how to build videos. Today I'm going to show you how to build two different scales of Pikachu. One is about minifigure scale, and the other is my sort of double figure scale that I use for a lot of different creations. So I'm using Super Smash Brothers as a size reference here, so in that Pikachu is just basically a little shorter than Mario, so that's how I sort of uh, scaled my two different versions of Pikachu here. Let's start with minifigure Pikachu. These are the pieces you'll need for Pikachu's body. So for Pikachu, um, this is a 1x2 plate with a hook off the side. I painted this part brown for the brown part of his tail. Uh, I've got these two one by one plates there, round plates. Those are nice little feet. It's a yellow torso with yellow arms and hands. Painted some brown stripes on the back to represent the stripes on Pikachu's back. Put that on there. Uh, for the tail, taking a one by one plate with a round uh, clip on the end, one by two tile, 1x2 plate, 1x2 tile, 1x2 plate, 1x1 tile. So the nice lightning bolt tail there. And what's nice is that it can then twist to the side or the back based on, you know, how you want it to go. Uh, Pikachu will start falling backwards at this point, but uh, that's okay. These are the pieces you'll need for Pikachu's head. The pieces set off to the right are a different way to build the head if you don't want to paint it. Start with the all-important Travis brick. If you haven't found some of these bricks yet, you need to go get them because they're really, really good for a lot of different uses. Uh, one by one plate on the top in yellow. Uh, the color of the Travis brick really doesn't matter here. It's going to mo mostly cover it up. One by one plate with a clip in yellow on each side. Let's do this uh, two by two radar dish in the back. Get that out of the way. Um, and then we're going to use these uh, little yellow uh, claw horn tooth pieces, uh, paint yellow with uh, black tips that I painted on, uh, capture Pikachu's ears. That was really the only piece I could find at this scale that looked uh, even remotely like it. Pikachu's ear. Um, and then you're going to take one of these 2x2 uh, two two dome pieces and paint a Pikachu face on it. Uh, key features here are his big red cheeks little black eyes and a nose and a smile if you can get them in. And then that's just going to go on right like that. Alternatively, if you don't want to paint or don't have that dome piece, you could try to do a brick built face, two by two round plate in yellow, some one by one black round plates there for the eyes, a red jumper plate, uh, and then I happen to have one of these one by one tiles in yellow with a three on them. Uh, which I thought did a good little job of making his uh, mouth smile there. So that's uh, not the best looking Pikachu, but it's a pretty good approximation at this scale uh, with uh, brick built pieces. Uh, you know, you could always use a regular tile if you don't have the one with the three on it. Now we stick the head onto the body. And of course, if you don't want to make that brick built face, you've also got the painted face as an option for Pikachu here. Now let's move on to the double fig scale Pikachu. These are the pieces you'll need for Pikachu's body. So the key piece here are these one by two plates with uh, handles on them. I'm going to connect them like that. I'm going to take one of these two by two curvy slope things. Um, if you don't have that piece, you could also put a uh, two by two round plate with a two by two uh, tie round tile for his uh, Cute little stomach there. This piece is better, but you know, use what you got. Uh, and then for the feet here, we're going to take a uh, one by one plate with clip, two one by one rounds, another foot, clip those on at the bottom here. And uh, for the arms, we're going to take minifigure arms in yellow put the hand side on the top of the handle there and then bend them down and then they're sort of like cute little uh, fat little arms like Pikachu has. Hello! Hello! These are the pieces you need for Pikachu's tail. So take the Pikachu body you just built, take a one by one plate with clip and stick it into the bottom hinge. Then take a one by one headlight brick in brown 
stick it on top of that. Then do a 1x2 plate in brown into the back. Behind that, take a yellow corner plate. Then another yellow corner plate. Then ye a yellow 1x2 plate with a um, lip on the side. Connect that up. That's a nice little Pikachu tail there. Can wave up and down and twist to the side and back when it needs to. So it's got a lot of uh, mobility there, which I like. These are the pieces you need for Pikachu's head. Start off with a 1x1 one one plate with a clip on the top. Put a jumper plate underneath that. And actually we're going to be building up like this, so might as well rotate it now. 1x1 one one plate with a um, circle clip on the side. Two of those facing forward. Then do two of those facing backwards. Do a 1x2 plate. You can see I'm using one of my ugly painted plates here since you can't see the top. Um, let's go ahead and take these one by one plates with clips on the side, put them on the back here, and let's go ahead and put his cheeks on. One by one red plates on these uh, clips on the front. Now we're going to take a two by two plate uh, and put some one by one black round pieces on it. Now we're going to put that on top of there so we've got eyes above the cheeks. Top the whole thing off with one of these 2x2 two two round bottom tiles, smooth circular thingies for the top of the head. I'm going to take some of these spikes that we got in yellow and painted the tips black. And uh, those will be his ears. And you can put those in the clips and then, uh, you know, twist them up a little bit for different po ear poses. Last step, take the body and connect the head the clip on the bottom to that handle in the middle of the body and now the head can go there and you can pose the tail and the legs a little bit so yeah there's uh, two different versions of Pikachu a lot of people in the comments were asking for Pokemon so I figured I'd start with the most famous one if there are other Pokemon you'd like me to do in Lego just let me know which ones you'd like to see in the comments and uh, we'll go from there but uh, thanks for watching and keep on building Pikachu